Hello everyone. I hope you are all doing well. I'm Manhar and welcome back to MSFT webcast. In today's video, we are going to learn the steps on how to convert Microsoft Entra synced on-premises user to cloud only. Unfortunately, converting a synced user object to a cloud only still not supported at this time. The only way to convert a synced object to cloud only is by disabling direct synchronization, but this will also convert all other synced objects. If you are using Microsoft Entra Connect and planning to decommission your on-premises active directory, you will eventually need to remove Microsoft Entra Connect and convert all users to cloud managed identities. Microsoft Entra Connect synchronize your on-premises AD objects with Microsoft Entra ID providing users with a cloud identity alongside the on-premises identity. However, the on-premises Active Directory remains the authoritative source for identity management. Users and groups synchronized with Microsoft Entra Connect must be managed in Active Directory and any changes made to those accounts are then synchronized to Microsoft Entra ID. So when you want to transition your identities to be cloud managed, you have two options. You can either perform the conversion gradually for small groups of users or you can bulk convert all your users at once. The easy way to do one of conversions is to move target users to an OU Microsoft Entra Connect is not syncing. On the next sync cycle, that user will be deleted in Microsoft Entra ID since it thinks the user was deleted from on-premises Active Directory. If you restore the user in Microsoft Entra ID, the user account will become cloud managed. And that we are going to do in this video. This method is fine for small groups of users, but if you want to convert all your users in bulk, you have to disable on-premises directory sync to Microsoft Entra ID. We will cover that in the next video. In this video, we just want to convert one on-premises sync user to cloud only. As I mentioned earlier, the option to change a specific user's status to cloud only is not available at this time. In this example, we will convert the user account Vishalkedia to a cloud-only account. Check the status of on-premises sync enabled. It is currently set to yes for this user account. Let's go to our domain controller VM. In the first step, we will move the user account to non-sync OU in on-premises active directory. Open run menu, type dsa.msc and hit enter key. This will open active directory users and computers. Remember, we are only syncing the India OU and the child OUs stored under the India OU. The Vishal KDI user account is currently stored in the user's OU which is being synced with Microsoft Entra ID. Let's move the user account to another OU. Right click on user account and select move. Select the destination OU and click OK. Verify that the user is no longer stored under the user's OU. Let's go to our Microsoft Entra Connect server. Now let's run a Delta Sync in the Microsoft Entra Connect tool to synchronize the changes immediately. This will move the user in Microsoft Entra ID to deleted users container. Right click on Start menu and select Terminal Admin. For Delta Sync, type command Start AD Sync Sync Cycle hyphen policy type Delta. Press Enter key to run the command. Command executed successfully. Let's wait for the Delta Sync to complete. After the Delta Sync is completed, the link between the user and Microsoft Entra ID will be broken and the user will be moved to the deleted users section. Let's verify this in Microsoft Entra Admin Center. Go back to Microsoft Entra Admin Center. Click on Refresh to view the updated information. Verify that Vishal Kedia's user account is no longer listed on the All Users page as the account has been deleted after the Delta Sync. Click on Deleted Users and verify that the user account is listed there. We can confirm that Vishal Kedia's user account is stored under the Deleted Users. Select the user account from Deleted Users page and click on Restore User. Vishal Kedia has been restored successfully. Once the user account has been restored, it will appear in the All Users section of the Microsoft Entra Admin Center. Click on All Users. Verify that Vishal Kedia's user account is now present on the All Users page. Notice the No value in the On-Premises Sync Enabled Status column which indicates that the user account is now a cloud-only account. There is no data loss when a user account is moved to deleted users. 
Microsoft keeps deleted user account for 30 days before permanent deletion. Open new in private window. Tap the URL entra.microsoft.com and press the enter key to access the Microsoft Entra admin center. Enter the user's UPN address which is vishal at msftwebcast.in. Click next. Enter user's password and click on sign in. Click on yes. The user can successfully access the Microsoft Entra Admin Center without any issues. This means we have successfully converted Microsoft Entra Synced on-premises user to cloud only. Let me remind you that this method is suitable for small groups of users. However, if you need to convert all your users in bulk, you will need to disable directory synchronization in Microsoft Entra ID. Don't forget to check out the next video to learn how to disable directory synchronization in Microsoft Entra ID. That's all for this video. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you have any questions or need further clarification, please leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on Microsoft Entra ID and other Microsoft related topics. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.